Today we'll be showing you how to build your own Wi-Fi robot. We're using a hacked RC car and a Linksys network camera. We're also using the standard Linksys router you can commonly find at Walmart and Target. We're using the roboticsredefined.com Barracuda Wi-Fi robot controller and we have a 5 volt regulator to power the camera. We will begin by installing the Barracuda Wi-Fi controller. We have our yellow and blue and red leads that connect to the motor. We'll slide the controller in. Start with the yellow lead. Now we'll connect the red and blue lead. This will allow power to go to the motor. The Barracuda is rated for 15 amps continuous and 30 amps peak, so it can handle quite a variety of motors. We'll now connect the power just to test, make sure everything's working properly. And we have a green, now blinking red light. We will now connect the steering servo to the Barracuda. The red lead we are currently connecting goes to common or ground. We will now connect the white lead, which is the signal source for the servo. The Barracuda has two ports that are capable of being analog or digital inputs, digital outputs, or RC outputs. The servo is powered by a third 7.2 volt battery. We replaced the stock steering mechanism with the standard RC servo. The battery also powers a 5 volt regulator, which in turn powers our Linksys network camera. The Barracuda communicates via the gray Ethernet cable, which is plugged into the router. The router is powered by the same 7.2 volt battery that powers the servo and the camera. The network camera is connected to the router via the blue ethernet cable. I will now secure the router in place. Alright, it's time for a test drive. For more information on building your own Wi-Fi robot or the Barracuda Wi-Fi robot controller, check us out at www.roboticsredefined.com.